Good afternoon, smart viewers. Welcome back to another episode of Face to Face. My name is Josh. I'm going to be your host for today. You know, usually if you ask someone about beauty, right, you, they usually focus on the outside characteristics such as their nose or they have nice hair or pretty eyes. But very rarely do is a per, does a person respond to that question and say, you know, what I find beautiful about that person is their personality, their sense of humor, their courage. And so we have this thing between outer beauty and inner beauty, which that was something I want to talk about today and the topic of the beauty inside. We have our ghost guest today. Hello, Steph Johnny. Hello. Good to meet Josh. you. Yeah, I am nice so glad you, you are here today. Mm -hmm. So we're going to talk about this thing about beauty. But before we do that, do you want to introduce yourself to our viewers? Yes, yeah, sure. Hello, viewers. I'm Steph Johnny Galip. I'm a mass communication, Venusian 2018. Awesome. Yeah, so awesome. well, so glad that you can be here. So let's talk about this. We're going to talk about beauty today. Mm -hmm. Before we get into deep about be inner beauty, outer beauty, tell me, what is your definition of beauty? Well, beauty, according to me, um, it has two perspectives. The first one is outer beauty, mm -hmm. which is physical beauty. You can see by your eyes, you know, like you said at the opening act, like how nice their eyes are and then how plump their leaves, something like that, which nowadays can be made, you mm. know, artificial yeah. beauty, facelift, mm -hmm. Botox, something like that. But on the other hand, the outer beauty is the beauty you can see through the soul. You know, Ooh, like when you see someone, mm -hmm. well, they might be, you know, the next door girl, but when you see them, they have something that draws you, draws you to, you know, look at them and then say that this one is really beautiful. Wow, so it's, uh, they, what's the quote? The quote is beauty is in the eye of the beholder, right? Mm -hmm. You can see their beauty, you know, eyes are the windows to a person's yes, soul. Yes, that's right. So, okay, so we have these two different uh, things, outer beauty, inner beauty, mm -hmm. physical, you know, the outer is based on your physical mm -hmm. appearances. Uh, and so tell me about this because here nowadays, I mean, the, the easiest thing to look at another person and judge them is based on their outer looks. Yes, right? that's right. What we're human. Right. What do you think about that? Like, wha how we're so easy to judge people on the outside based on the inside? Well, we as the human, we know that we have that kind of something chemical in our brain mm -hmm. that attract that that is um, that attract people. You know, that will uh, get us attracted to people by their physical beauty. We cannot deny that. Mm -hmm. We cannot say that. Oh, I love at the first. I love him or her at the first sight because he got or she got a sense of humor or um, yeah. Because I can see the beauty inside her or him. It's but like it's like a book, right? When we we judge a book based on their cover. Before yeah, and we that's open right. It. We you know when you buy a book, you will see the cover first, mm -hmm. and then oh, is it good or not? Mm -hmm. And then you will read. Um, the synopsis mm -hmm. behind it, mm -hmm. and then you will judge it. Oh, this is a kind of book I want to buy. Mm -hmm. Same. It is same like uh, the people. You see the physical beauty first, and then you will learn to know them more. Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah. yeah. But, but hold on. But what if what if someone isn't beautiful? What if because uh, we have these standards? Mm -hmm. I mean, standards of beauty of of good looking mm -hmm. or beautiful and not beautiful, or in other words, ugly, mm -hmm. right? Uh, so what, what, how do we, I mean, later, later on, we're going to try to change that perspective, see how we as humans can mm -hmm. really try to look. So before we do, let's, let's keep talking about this. So uh, let's talk about society. Society creates and even perpetuate these ideal, gender ideals, in other words, uh, to, 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 to like they, they have these standards mm -hmm. of what um, a perfect woman or a perfect man is. So what do you think, uh, what are some ideals of you believe that is a perfect woman and a perfect man? Well, perfect women and men change um, through decades. Mm -hmm. Like in some era, the perfect men or women can be like, um, for men, it might be muscular, mm -hmm. um, while the women might be fatter is better. Mm -hmm. Well, in fact, nowadays, people prefer the skinnier, p uh, the skinnier person, mm -hmm. and then uh, which has, you know, big, big certain places mm -hmm. in their body. Yeah, <laughs> yeah mm, I think society and media mm. has the big impact on this situation nowadays. And I think that um, that is true. You know, the ideal of beauty um, in each region of uh, our world is the, um, different with each other. Like 
as Asian, you know, mm, how would you prefer Asian girls? Yeah, uh, I mean, they're, uh, I mean, Asian. See, here's the thing. Like, uh, everybody has different preferences, right? Uh -huh. But uh, let's talk about. Okay, you tell me. What are uh -huh. what are what is your ideal Asian man? Go we'll start. Ideal with there. Asian man. Yes. Tall. Tall. Mm, white guy. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um. The Asians like the white yeah. people, don't they? Yes. Well, West, you know. Prefer tan yeah, skin. Yeah, so like, so like here we want the whiter people, and over there they want <laughs> the darker people. Yes, yes, that's right. Like the West comes here to find tan skin girl, something like that. Yeah. Wow. So, so like you said, like beauty is based on region, different mm -hmm. regions. You know, mm -hmm. they have different standards mm -hmm. of beauty, and also throughout history, uh, like you said, back in the day, and even actually some uh, some parts here. Like uh, I did some research in Fiji, yes, in Mauritania, mm -hmm. West Africa. They believe that. Fat is beautiful. Yes, fat right? is better. Uh, back in the Renaissance, back in the er, you know early mm -hmm. ages, like they believe that the fatter you are, that means you're wealthy. Yeah, right? it, they link yeah. that to wealth. But here, that's right. Now it's different. Yeah, right? because so you know beauty changes. Exactly, mm -hmm. and beauty is going to keep changing. It's going to keep evolving. Mm -hmm. What was once uh, we might not know that in five or ten years, right? Uh, the era of you know the fat is better will will be back. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe I I should move to Fiji. You I know? mean, <laughs> you know, they'll find you beautiful there. Yes. You're, you're, you're white skin. You know, like everybody, everybody always goes for the white skin, right? Yes. Um, but no, it doesn't mean that tan skin girl isn't beautiful. Right. Because for a lot of people, yeah. Tan skin girl but is But here we are not talking about the outer right. physical beauty, yeah. right? Exactly. Yeah. We're gonna dive in a little bit more to the mm -hmm. inner beauty. Before that, we gotta break down these these stereotypes, these mm -hmm. characteristics. Okay. So when we come back from our commercial break, we're gonna talk about inner beauty and how to identify that. We'll be back. Stay tuned, guys. Hey, guys. Welcome back to Face to Fierce. Here I am with Septrani. We're talking about the beauty inside. So earlier we talked about what is the beauty, you know, beauty has different standards all and it, it's evolving, it's changing always and we figured out that people only focus more on outer beauty mm -hmm. and that is just, it's too shallow, you know. So now I want to dive into inner beauty, right? So tell me, what, what is your definition of inner beauty? Well, inner beauty is when you can spread kindness mm. and stop judging people by their cover. I mean, when you look um, when you look into someone, um, maybe you will find them not suit uh, to your standard of, you know, people tend to be friended with um, people who are attractive, mm -hmm. right, mm -hmm. and popular. Mm -hmm. Well, in fact, maybe several people um, we met and then we didn't get the chance to get to know each other are the people who, you know, who are something kind of special yeah. and we miss the chance because we judge the book by the cover, we judge people by their physical appearance. Right. And it's easy because uh, people that we may think are popular or mm -hmm. attra you know, outside attractive, really sometimes they might have some insecurity. Yeah, insecurity, a lot of deep things but below yes. the surface. Yes. Uh, which, but doesn't I mean that's not always that way mm -hmm. but again you can't judge a book by its the cover. cover, you can't tell yeah. people based on their mm -hmm. outer outside appearance. Now, uh, earlier you touched on how the media, the mm -hmm. media is one of the influences. So actually, now it's one of the major influences mm -hmm. of beauty. We have magazines telling people how to, what's beautiful. We have TV shows of beautiful people, yes. successful people and beauty. Talk, talk, mm. talk to me, tell me about this, these, this media real quick. Well, in an era of TV show, reality show nowadays, you know, mm, a program called Keeping Up With The Kardashians, yeah. you know, the pretty girls with very, very attractive body yeah. and well, you know, they they do the plastic surgery. Yeah, yeah. But, well, if you have the money, it's okay. Right. But I mean, that TV show really shapes um, the ideal of beauty mm -hmm. of the people. For girls, they want to be like them. Why? Because, yes, be, uh, when I turned to be like Kim K, for mm -hmm. example, mm -hmm. maybe I will attract more guys. Mm -hmm. While, mm, in other hand, for the guys, when they see the Keeping Up With The Kardashians show, wow, that is the ideal beauty people are talking about. I want to get the girl like that. Mm. But it's unreal, you right. know? It's unrealistic. Mm -hmm. 
except you're getting the plastic surgery. Right. So I didn't blame people uh, who watched that and then were shaped mm -hmm. um, to the ideal beauty mm -hmm. the show gives us. But once again, mm, I don't think that the show really educates us. Right in any way right mm -hmm. it just sets unrealistic expectations yes that's unrealistic right. expectations that mm -hmm. not everybody can meet you know not everybody has money to spend mm -hmm. on altering yes, their body and why right. we're created to be unique we're mm -hmm. created to be different and that's what makes this world special is mm -hmm. all there are uniqueness and difference but if you try to to try to be like somebody else then why? you just lose your exactly. you know lose yourself right mm -hmm. and, and that then and once you do that it's hard to really figure out mm -hmm. your life right so how do we how do you feel like we can focus and identify on, uh, just like we groom our outer beauty, how do you feel like each person individually can grow their inner beauty? Well, first, it starts within yourself. Love yourself, pos be positive, you know, positive talk to yourself, mm -hmm. respect yourself, and be forgiving, mm -hmm. you know. Most people, I know, I have been through that phase when you look through the mirror and then you just cry and break down mm -hmm. because you know that you're not as beautiful as the other person mm -hmm. or you know s uh, the guy you have been mm, liked for months just you know like a other girl who you know are is prettier than you and then you will just cry because you're too ugly oh man mm. yeah that's terrible yes Why? I, you're, I've you're been wasting your time right yeah and i just realized nowadays that no, I'm. I shouldn't be in that phase anymore. Mm -hmm. I have to get out, and mm -hmm. then um, I have to um, have that thought in my mind that beauty is not all about appearance, the right. physical appearance. Right. I can be kind. I can be my special own self, mm -hmm. and then people can see it. And then um, when I try to change myself, people are you know slowly uh, starts to befriended with me right because mm -hmm. I, I believe that everybody in their uniqueness mm -hmm. you know that's attractive in itself when you're trying to be someone else people will see through that people will see you're just trying to put on this fake identity. and nobody likes yeah, being and fake we will be tired yeah that's you the biggest know, thing yeah. that's the biggest thing of why we should mm -hmm. stop trying to be somebody else because it again it's not gonna last mm -hmm. we can put on we can only put on so much makeup we can wear the fanciest clothes but one day it's just it's not gonna be important yeah, beauty fades right and mm -hmm. so what's more important is what's inside you because that yeah. that's what stays that's what stays yeah that's what stays yeah. you're kind now you you won't be like you won't change mm -hmm. like you kind now you'll be kind of future right. if you're happy uh, you're spreading happiness mm -hmm. and then you will keep being the happy virus yeah. to the people around yeah. you and people yes. li like those kind yes. of things. so what you're saying is the way we just like we do the pl you know we mm -hmm. can do plastic surgery we can wear the fancy clothes we can put on as much makeup on the outside the way to do the to, to grow your inner beauty mm -hmm. is to really like you said start with yourself well, i named it pretty pretty you know the physical appearance yeah. the beauty yeah. outside i named it pretty okay mm -hmm. and then so yeah start with yourself you got to start with your inner personality um, ac yes. accept and appreciate yourself yes, why? and then just let let that be because yeah. eventually that's going to be attractive that's what's truly mm -hmm. attractive i learned that a lot of my friends the girls especially they are so pretty outside yeah but when they just bad mouthing yeah. other people, so oh, I nope. was, <laughs> you're not fit into the society. And maybe, maybe for some people, they might like that. They be like, oh yeah, we'll, we'll talk bad about people. We'll be really, but yes. then eventually, it's not gonna last. Yes, that's right. Because you know, when you talk to, when you talk about someone's life, the p uh, the view of yourself, the image of yourself uh, to the other people will be bad. Yeah. I mean. Who's gonna have time to talk about others' people' life? You know. Oh no, they do. I mean, yeah. but we do. Uh -huh. But it's not gonna last forever, yes. and it's gonna be boring. Mm -hmm. So why not start now mm -hmm. to grow that inner self, mm -hmm. right? Um, anyways, inner beauty, such uh, you know, something we want to focus on. Don't focus too much on the outside. Mm -hmm. Just really focus on your inside. Keep it going, like you said. Uh, grow it like be kind be kind mm -hmm. be kind to people be positive yeah I think it really starts with the small things you can't just be like I'm gonna wake up and be kind no, and be no, beautiful it takes inside. time it takes time and you have to keep being consistent the most important thing is that you start within yourself that is the key yeah. you know the change of something starts within you mm -hmm. if you do not want to forgive yourself because um, you're just too fat or 
too ugly, too, I have too many acne or something like that. You won't change right. forever. Yeah. You have to be forgiving and then you have to say, it, yes, I love you to the That's mirror. It. That's it. So don't compare, focus on yourself. Yeah, because right? there, are, there are even more, more many people that is will be prettier and thinner, something like that. Anyways. Yeah, you, wow. you can't uh, deny it. That's right. Uh -huh. Anyways, we're going to come back after the commercial break to talk a bit more about inner beauty. Stay tuned. Hey guys, welcome back to Face to Face. I'm here with Septrani. We're just gonna play a little game. Yeah, I love Is that games. Okay? You like games? I like games <laughs> yeah. too. Okay, so what's we're gonna do? We're gonna do a little charades. You know, I'm gonna mm -hmm. have some some things here on on my phone, some mm -hmm. words, mm -hmm. and I need you to act them out, and I'm gonna have to guess what they are. You got that right? Yes. Okay. You ready for this? Mm -hmm. Okay, just act it out. Do your best. You can't say the word here. Oh, I cannot say. You can't say the word, but the you can word. act it out. Okay. Some you know sound effects but, are good. But can I um, explain about like uh, some words related to that word? Just use your actions though. Okay. Charades. You got this. All right. Okay. So uh, I'm gonna start. I'm ready. One minute. Let's see how many we can get in one minute. Mm -hmm. All right. You ready for this? Here we go. Ready? Okay. Ah. See if I can do this. Uh, putting on lotion. Yes, that's right. Oh my gosh. No, 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 that's pass. Oh, right, sorry, wrong one. No. <laughs> okay. Uh-huh, pass. Uh, pass. Mm. <laughs> this one? Uh-huh, putting on uh, pants? No, no, no. No? Uh, lower, okay. Uh, pass. pass. <laughs> Crying. Mm -hmm. Oh. Pouring water, shaking, making a latte, smoothie, pouring, uh, shaking, uh, squeezing. Uh, uh, pass. <laughs> Happy, you're running, you're really happy. Uh, uh, there's a board, uh -huh. and then you sit on them. I sit on the board, and you're, and you you're just rowing. Oh. Are, you swi are you swinging? Yes. Swinging? Yes, yes. Really? Correct. Oh, wow. Uh, mm, I cannot mention any word. Uh, no, you can't. OK. Uh, uh, OK, skip. One more. Cold? Oh, OK. No, OK. Uh, um, running, uh, climbing, climbing, pointing. Uh, no, no, no. So, Trani, you're <laughs> terrible at this game. You're absolutely <laughs> terrible at this game. All right, hold on. What wow, were the words? This sucks. Okay, what were the words? Okay, putting on lotion. Oh my gosh, yes, you got yes, that. Yes, that's right. Blowing your nose. Yeah, no. that's the one you crying, pass on. Crying, going upstairs. Yes. And oh, mixing a drink. Yes. Okay. Oh, oh my gosh. All right, is let's try this turn? again. It is your turn. Let's do this. Okay. Are you ready? ready? I'm ready. Uh, you know, nope. Never mind. Skip that one. Go up, up, up. Yep. Uh, nope. Skip. Why are you skipping? Okay. You're also terrible. No, we're skipping this well, one. No, you're <laughs> also a terrible gamer. Um, um, um rowing boats. Mm, keep going. Um, row. Skip. Row. Skip. Row. Skip. Skip. <laughs> Snake. Yeah. Um, sat. Yep. Uh, skip. <laughs> uh, skip. <laughs> Why are you keep skipping? Oh, okay, skip that one. No, it's so hard. No way. I can't. Okay. <laughs> um, roller coaster. Yes. Knock knock. Knock. Uh, entering the door. Knock knock. Cat. No. Okay. Knock knock is good. Knock knock. Is Go. <laughs> You're okay. Also a terrible That's good. Player. Yeah, I am. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. It was. Hold on. You gotta, look, look, at, you gotta look at the words. Tail. Yeah, it's a, oh, as yeah, a, as yeah. a tail. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tail. Oh. Putting in gas. Knocking on a door. Knock your knock. ones uh, are harder. Yeah. Can we play once more? One more. One let's, more see, let's see one, la one last game. Are you ready yeah. for this? Here we go. We can do this. I'm going to do this. This is going to be right. Spraying. Spraying. Uh, watch. Uh, uh, black. Uh, tan. Tanning. Tanning? Uh. Tan lotion. Tan lotion. Spray tan. Spray tan. <laughs> Uh, throwing a baby in the air. <laughs> no! <laughs> Who will throw a baby? <laughs> uh, basketball, scooping, tennis, badminton. Pass? Pass. <gasps> Shock. Scared. Uh-huh. Mm, cold? It's cold. Uh-huh. Uh, Snow? Globe? Mm, snow? Uh-huh. 
Snow globe, snowball. Carrot? Snow, uh, snowman. Yeah. Oh, um, p pass? When you're in traffic, really heavy traffic, and then you just... Honk. Uh-huh. In Honk Jakarta what? traffic. Honk, Honk the what? horn. Yeah. It's itchy. Yeah. Fly. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just so expressive. Wow, good job. No. I'm scared, Ed. No, you're okay. good. Okay, uh, spray tan, a uh -huh. volleyball. Yeah. Scared. That's your scare throw face. a baby. Yep. <laughs> it's <laughs> itch flying. All right, good job. Like the Sims, throwing baby. Oh, that was fun. All right, <laughs> let's go back to this topic of beauty. That's exciting, it's actually. So exciting. A little, a little fun before we get yeah. back to the discussion. Mm -hmm. So we talked about what beauty is. We talked about inner beauty, outer beauty. Mm -hmm. Also, we talked about how to how to separate it and how to not let bad beauty influence your inner and how to grow your inner beauty, right? And so, finally, before we do that, how will you, as a person, personally, want to, you know, spread beauty? How will you want to do it, personally, you, Septrani? Well, I have done several things, such as, first, um, you know, the social media impact nowadays. Mm -hmm. I just keep spreading words, quotes about um, encouragement through my post in Instagram and you know it might not be related to the picture but at least mm, I have some good words to be shared yeah. on the caption mm -hmm. and then second um, I, I have learned more about myself uh, how to love myself and then not letting other people to bring me down yep. because you know what doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Oh, come on, what doesn't kill Sorry, I'm not going to say <laughs> Okay, and then, you know, um, there will be many, many people who, who still wants to influence you badly, mm -hmm. but you must stay strong. That's it, that is the word from Saptrani, mm -hmm. amazing. So as she said, guys, stop worrying about your outside, you know, beauty will fade. Beauty does, I mean, beauty fades, but also it changes, Yes. right? Through and decades. So, through decades, but also in your lifetime. Mm -hmm. So instead of worrying about the wrinkles on your face or what you're wearing, rather think about what you can be. You can be more kind, you can be more caring, more loving, more happy, mm -hmm. more positive. Mm -hmm. Think about how you can leave your mark on this world in a positive way. Guys, thank you so much for joining us for Face to Face today. My name is Josh Septrani. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for, so much for inviting me. And we'll see you guys next week face to face. Thank you so much.